Uh, I ordered some food from this place called Bad Chicken, and the chicken was really bad, so I wanted to see if I can get my money back. Yes, we apologize if you're having issue with the order that you place, but let me help you. Can I have the phone number that was connected to the account? 865-606-4689. And the restaurant was called Bad Chicken. I, I was thinking it was going to be good because normally when people say things are bad, they're only good. But I tried it and the chicken was really, really bad. Like, it tastes like, it tastes like they're just like, slaughtered a chicken in the back room and just threw in a deep fryer. Mm -hmm. All right, we sincerely apologize for that, but just wanted to make sure I'm speaking with Ryan. That's me, Ryan. Daddy Ryan. All right. All right, so Ryan, when I tried to use the phone number that you provided, I'm not seeing any order reflect here. Did you just place this order today? Yes. Do you have any other phone number? Maybe it was connected to a different phone number. Uh, can you try up my email address? Yep, we can do that. Can I have it? Yes, it is. Give me a moment here. V A G I N A P R A N K S at gmail dot com. The restaurant's called Bad Chicken. Like it, it was definitely. Definitely wasn't good chicken, so I would consider it to be bad chicken. They definitely lit up to their name, like, it's definitely pretty bad. The fries were literally as hard Sorry as... Sorry about that, The fries were literally as hard as a rock. A damn dendrus popped out trying to eat the... The damn fries, they were so hard. It was almost like they, like, mm -hmm. took, like, gravel off the sidewalk. I understand you with that. I will definitely pull the same, but uh, Rain, I tried to pull up the account here using the email, but we're not seeing any email. Uh, I mean, we're not seeing any account connected with this email. So just wanted to make sure if I got it correctly. It's Z as in zebra, A as in apple, Z as in Gary, A, um, I as in igloo, N as in Nancy, A as in apple, T as in Peter, and then R as in Romeo, N as in Nancy, A as in apple, K as in Kevin at gmail.com, is that correct? So it's V as in Victor, A as in Apple, G as in George, I as in Igloo, N as in Nancy, A as in Apple, P as in Peter, R as in Robert, A as in Apple, A N as in Nancy, K S at gmail.com. Sorry about all the confusion. How's your night going, Habibi? I'm good, thank you for asking. I tried to use this email, but we're not seeing any account. Did you, did Do you, you have an order number? Did you spell it correctly? It's V as in Victor, A as in Apple, G as in George, I as in Igloo, N as in Nancy, A as in Apple, P as in Peter, R as in Romeo, A as in Apple, N as in Nancy, K as in Kevin, is that correct? There's an S at the end of that. I'm sorry? There's an S after the K, so it's P-R-N-K-S. S, alright. S as in Sam? Yeah, that's right. All right, let's try to use this one. All right, I 
I already pulled up the order details here from Bad Chicken. And regarding on the order that you've got, which is the chicken, can you please elaborate what's wrong about this order? Yeah, so the chicken was like really, really weird. Like it was like basically not even cooked right. It tasted like it was almost like raw or maybe like they like used kind of like weird like seasoning on it. Cause it was like really, really weird. It was like so like soggy looking on the outside and like just like really like tastes like they didn't even cook it all the way and then like the fries were like burnt to a char it was basically just eating like like little rocks on the sidewalk it was really like the fries were so hard but damn dentures almost popped out of my mouth mm -hmm. all right so Ryan, for us to be able to check if we can process your refund for the ISM with the order, I'll be needing the picture of the ISM that you have. So I'll send you an email so that you can send the picture to us, okay? We just need to check it. All right. I've already kind of thrown the food away, but I've got trying to message some other people on DoorDash trying to get a refund, and they just... I don't know, I don't know how I get these pictures back, but... There should be some kind of like order dispute thing on, on your guys app. Actually we're not seeing any picture on that case as well as on this email ad I mean on this order details. That's why we will be needing the clear picture of the order that you have so that we can check if we can process your refund for that. <clears throat> Alright, I've gotta go outside and take a picture of this food. I just threw it away. There to go. Sorry about that, Ryan. It's just that it's part of our process here, so that's why we need to make sure. Let's see. By the way, I already sent the email to your email address. Once you're able to take a picture, just click your place, the email that I sent to you, and then attach the picture. Alright, give me just a second. I don't even have access to that email address anymore. Is there any chance that, like, you give me the email address to send it to you? Yeah, can you have the email address that you have, which is the correct email address that you have access to? Yes, try H A L L S K K I H at gmail.com. That's right. <laughs> I'm projectile vomiting now. The place is literally called Bad Chicken. You can tell they don't take pride and the quality of their food, they're literally called bad chicken. And let me tell you, it's really, really bad. Mm -hmm. I understand you with that. The food is terrible. It really tastes like it was part of a dog's ass. We sincerely apologize about that, Ryan. I will definitely follow the team. But I already sent the email to the email address that you provided. Can you check if you received it? Oh crap! Yeah, I got it. I just replied to it a blank with a blank email. Let's see. You should be getting that the two pictures here any second now. As you can see, like, look at that chicken. It literally looks like 
they didn't even like bread it properly. It tastes like crap. Like it literally tastes like literally tastes like dog food. And then like the the fries were so like overcooked. They literally were like so hard. They're literally like like bones. Like my dog probably wanted me to eat them. I wouldn't even feel into a homeless person. Yeah, I did. I'm in the bottom. Oh, right. I am not seeing any email here. Let's check. I just sent it a minute ago, so it should be there any minute now over in Indonesia. <clears throat> that food is terrible. Is there any chance you get bad chicken removed from your platform? Because the food is really, really bad. They even put bad in their name. Like, that's how bad it is. Mm -hmm. We'll take note of your feedback here so that we can prevent this from happening again. We really got those, those pictures. Alright, one moment. I'm still checking if we receive the email. It's like Here, so I'll try if we can back right now. Okay. <clears throat> Can't believe they would serve such terrible food. The food literally is so disgusting. <clears throat> Making fraud chicken isn't rocket science. I hear a lot of typing over there. Do we have any solution on this matter? Alright. Alright, I already checked our system here. Alright, so I'm actually tried if we can process you but our system is not letting us to process any compensation. So what we're going to do here, I'm going to forward your case to our specialty team so that <coughs> they can thoroughly investigate what happened about this. So I'm going to use the picture that you've, uh, that you've sent here as an evidence for the issue with your order. So it can take up to 24 hours, so we suggest to wait for that. And our specialty team will be sending you an email regarding the resolution. And it can take up to 24 hours. Just to check your email time to time. Why do they have to review this? Because the chicken is bad. It's literally called bad chicken. Like, if that isn't proof enough, I don't know what they need. Do you want, do you want me to like pull out my ass and show them, like, hey, look at this chicken? Like, how, how it didn't digest probably. Yeah, I understand you with this. That's why we're going to use the photo that you've, uh, that you've sent as an evidence for the issue with your order. And then after that, they will be investigating. Um, so am I going to have my money back? Because the chicken is bad chicken, so I would like my money back. Because it's, it's literally called bad chicken. Uh, for now, we suggest to wait for the resolution. Because our specialty team is the one who's going to provide you a resolution about the order. But what if it's like some guy who's prejudiced who doesn't like white people? I'm sorry? I'm a I'm a black man. I order a lot of fried chicken, so I just want to make sure it's not gonna be kind of like prejudice against you for being black. I understand you with that. I understand you with that. It's just that here in Bordash we have a process here. Once we're unable to process you anything from the order, then we have to forward your case to our internal team so that they can thoroughly check your Bordash account. 
So once they hear your door dash account, they will be immediately sending you an email regarding the resolution. Is there any chance to put on my on my case log thing that said I am black? So I do I do take things very seriously. Actually we're not allowed to do that, but we'll document your concern here about your orders so that they will be informed. Cause I'm, I'm a black man with fried chicken and grape soda kind of sore, so the fact that they would produce such horrifying food is just, is just is, is a disgrace. I understand you with that, but again, we're trying to help you regarding this concern, and you just have to wait within 24 hours for the resolution. If I don't get a refund, I'm just going to consider it discrimination because I'm black, so if I don't get a refund, we very... We're not actually sure because our specialist team needs to thoroughly investigate your DoorDash account. That's why we're asking you to wait for it within 24 hours for the resolution. So it says I got a $5 refund. That's it? The food was literally shit. Are you telling me that if you that goat fuckers is... can't afford me a full refund for food that was messed up? No, it actually is not. I think I think you only issued a partial refund because I'm black. No, we're not allowed that. Uh, we're not allowed to do that here. Because you, you said. Our refund is a system out of Because you said as soon as I said that I was black that you would only issue a partial refund. You're like, oh, this is the maximum we can do. It's no. only five dollars. Okay. We do not tolerate that kind of behavior here. What we're do you mean? We're not discriminating you regarding this. And we're just trying to help you. If our specialist team already brought the period refund, then kindly understand that's the maximum amount of refund that you can have. Because here in Voradash, our refund is a system automated. Do you mean that because I'm black, then I'm not going to get a full refund? No. No. We treat our customer equally. So black people get treated worse because they're black? No. You seem like you're, you definitely don't like black people. No. We're not allowed to do that here. So again, since I already explained everything here, Ryan, and since our specialist team already pressed you refund and that's the maximum amount, so I'll be disconnecting this phone. Thank you so much. Have a good one, goat fucker. Have a good one, goat fucker. Goodbye.